Reaper, we keep it rough, we keep it raw, we keep it real. Make sure you subscribe to the Reaper because I'm doing good things here at Reaper. All right, precise. Is he a madman? Last night on the show, precise was acting like a madman, acting like he needed to be caged up and maybe sent to the brig because precise you know he was in the marine corps and everything like that and i don't know what went on in there or was he a crazy motherfucker before he went in there but what i do know is precise got some serious issues to reap a keep it 1000 and Corey spike the bulldog you may have to put him down, you know, <laughs> the Reaper Keep It 1000, because, you know, that mad dog may turn on you, and when he turns on you, then what you gonna do? The Reaper Keep It 1000, because Precise is a wild and crazy guy. And I also think he wants to smash Darlene Ortiz, the Reaper Keep It 1000, you know, uh, because one minute... He's saying that he'll fuck the shit out of Darlene, you know. And the next minute, he's saying Darlene is not all of that. And if you remember, you know, uh, Precise, when Corey was talking about the woman in the elevator, Precise said his mind, mind you, told him to grab her. He didn't scream when he grabbed her, but just because his mind told him to grab her, he grabbed, he would, he grabbed this woman, the Reaper Keep It 1000, and he is a very, very aggressive man, you know, uh, possibly too aggressive, you know, the Reaper Keep It 1000, and Precise really has the hots for Darlene. So Darlene better be careful. She better have somebody walk into a car because Precise could be fantasizing so hard about her. And he thinks she already like light skinned guys. But Precise don't got a ponytail. Precise look like Spike the Bulldog in the face. All he need is a spike collar. You know, the Reaper Keep It 1000. And then he acts like a wild man. And somebody, you know, with his psyche that's drinking and smoking or whatever he does, they could possibly do anything. Maripa keep it 1000. That's a loose cannon ready to go off, you know. And Corey may have to put his bulldog down one day because he may snap on him. And what you gonna do, Corey, when he snap on you? It seems like he's already out of control, you know. I mean, because that wasn't even the time or place to say what he was saying, you know. And just like with Marcus, when they was joking about Ryan Davis, Persis says that, you know, oh, if it's funny, it's funny. That's what he tell Marcus. Go ahead and laugh. But he can't take a joke. You know, he's snapping on everybody. And what is this? Precise don't lie. God damn it. Precise don't lie, god damn it. <laughs> you know, Precise needs to stay off the Patron and stay off of the other drugs that he's on because he could potentially, you know, get himself into a lot of trouble you know, and cause Corey a lawsuit because that bulldog is out of control. And I done told you, Corey, you need to put that bulldog at the end of the show. But you want to have that bulldog out front and talking over everybody, you know, being belligerent. So I think Corey has got that bulldog around. So if he say, sick him, precise, uh, jump on anybody the reaper keep it 1000 you could have a gun to his head and he still be talking shit and bow you know <laughs> it go off on his ass because he don't have the sense 
that God gave a billy goat. The Reaper Keep It 1000. You could tell that this man has no sense whatsoever. And he brings nothing to the table. And I told you, Darlene can't stand him because he's irritating to her. And she would love to replace him with iced tea. The Reaper Keep It 1000. <laughs> She want to replace him with iced tea because, you know, he's irritating, he's loud talking, and he looks like a brother that's out of control, that needs some counseling, that will do any damn thing. But it was good to see Corey back to his natural self, funny self. You know, that's what we miss about you, Corey. You know, you, uh, was back to your natural funny self and wasn't dwelling on the fuck shit. The Reaper Keep It 1000. You know. And uh, that's what we like about the story. It's funny. Especially when he asked Marcus. <laughs> you know. <laughs> when he asked Marcus had he ate some pussy before. You know what I'm saying. <laughs> you only ate one pussy. <laughs> that's what he asked Marcus. You know. And Marcus was fumbling and stumbling. Because I don't believe Marcus wanted to say that because other people was watching and his mama was probably watching. So Marcus didn't want to divulge that information. That's why he was fumbling and stumbling. And Corey stayed on that. <laughs> you know, uh, he said, look, I ain't no woman. You know, you can tell me what's real because I know you done ate more than one pussy. You know, <laughs> the Reaper Keep It 1000. So Corey stayed on the subject, but Marcus didn't want to divulge it. And Marcus was fumbling and stumbling. But what I'm saying about Precise, hey, keep that bulldog chained up. Unless that bulldog going to bite somebody, Corey. And you going to be liable. Reaper, we keep it rough. We keep it raw. We keep it real. Make sure you subscribe to the Reaper. Reaper out. Peace.